Oh, good evening, everyone. Mmm, you've caught me enjoying some delicious biscuits tea. Uh, and we have a trailer that we need to take a look at. And that's, um, uh, I've not seen anything thumbnail related to this. All I can see is obviously the uh, To Stay Dreaming title. Whatever that means, seems kind of generic to me. <laughs> Doesn't really give away the banner, I don't think, unless I'm just not thinking enough about it. Um, but hey, in case you missed it, we launched memberships on the channel today. If you want to check out what that is, what the perks are, blah 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 uh, If you missed the community post, I will link the video explaining all of that in this video's description. You can go check that out if you want. Uh, I didn't make it public. It's, un it's an unlisted video because I didn't want it blasting people who didn't care about it. So I didn't do that. <laughs> so I'm just, I'm making you aware of it now in case you want to know. Uh, we went more secret seller type of disbursement of this information. So check that out if you like. Subscribe if you have not. And let's watch this. Uh, I was assuming that it would be a genealogy three houses banner. Possibly Tokyo Mirage Sessions. I don't know. That looks like genealogy to me. That looks like a genealogy banner. No three houses, but that's okay. One cannot help but shine in such a splendid outfit. There's the Kesis. Lovely. Green Dagger Flyer. Alright, we're gonna take this bit by bit. I'm already gloating. I'm already gloating. I was right about genealogy. Bam! First I get corn and then I get genealogy banner. Bring it home. All right, so, courtly mask. That's fun. At start of combat, if unit's HP is greater than or equal to 50%, grants attack res plus five during combat. And also, if foe can make a follow-up attack, reduces damage from foe's first attack by 50%. What? 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 Why? <laughs> Why are we having all of these damage reduction skills popping up all of a sudden? It started with, like, Repel and stuff, and it has just gone... It's it's everywhere now. It is literally everywhere. Um, I feel like we've had at least one of those types of skills every month since April or May. Crazy. Okay. Either way, uh, Star Combat units HP is greater than 50%. Grants attack rest plus 5 during combat. Great! So, I'm assuming she's attack res heavy. Uh, probably not that fast. Uh, so, if foe can make a follow-up attack, reduces damage from first. Foe's first attack by 50%. So, I guess the idea behind that is uh, you take less damage on the first hit, assuming you'll get doubled, but uh, maybe you get a big enough attack bump that you can just finish it off before it can finish you off. I don't know. Uh, dance, obviously it's a dance <laughs> Duh! Uh, defense cantrip, I almost said catnip. Did anybody else almost think that said catnip? Let me know in the comments if you thought that said catnip. I don't want to be alone in this. Uh, if singer dance is used, inflicts defense minus seven on nearest foes within four spaces of unit through their next actions. What? Bruh. Alright. So, that's pretty, that's pretty nice. I appreciate that. Uh, and then we have air orders, which we know what that does, so we won't go into that. Uh, if you're new-er-ish to Fey, uh, you will know that most of these units are going to be flyer infantry units, for the most part. Because <laughs> they're dancers, that's kind of how they roll. Uh, but originally they, they used to only be infantries, but we've expanded into flyer dancers, I guess, uh, in more recent years. The art looks nice. I'm a fan. It is this is my pick. This is my pick. Ethelyn. So my I. girl. And Allegra Clark is voicing her? What? Bruh. Alright. I'm happy. I'm a happy, I'm a happy man. I'm a happy man. This is Ethelyn. Ethelyn is my, my, my girl. I have very often <laughs> thought about grailing Ethelyn to plus 10 multiple times, but I never did it because I was like, I have these other great healers that are already plus 10. I don't know if I need another one, but she's on a horse, so maybe that makes a difference. Maybe horse healers make a difference, and I should just do it. 
Maybe I will. Courtly Fan Plus. <laughs> if unit initiates combat, grants attack speed plus 5 during combat and neutralizes effects that prevent units follow-up attacks during combat. What? Okay, so we have... Um, uh, we have no follow-up, yeah, basically. <laughs> Built into a colorless dagger. Yo. I'm down for that. Uh, that is going to be foddered to a fair number of units, methinks. Um, yeah. I think that's going to be a fun Aether Raid skill that people are going to inherit onto some of their units, probably. Uh, dance, we've got Aether Raid's defense attack speed 3, so we have a new ARD skill. Uh, if defending an Aether Raid grants attack speed plus X during combat, and this is where it gets all algebraic -y. Uh, It calculates X based on the number of your defensive structures. Greater than or equal to 5 structures grants plus 10. 4 grants plus 7. 3 grants plus 4. And less than or equal to 2 grants plus 1. Hmm. I don't know who has 2 or fewer defensive structures in Aether Raids. Hmm. Oh well. Uh, destroyed defensive structures are not counted. Whoopsies. So we've got wind sweep, and then we have joint drive speed. Ah, oh, man. So, uh, I know they, they usually save the four star for last. Like, well, the third spot in a four person banner. They usually save that spot. But I saw wind sweep, and I was like, hmm. 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 Maybe, but uh, I'm, I'm guessing that just has to go along with her weapon. Uh, because we've got kind of like a, uh, what would that be? Uh, kind of like a fire sweep type effect, but only for uh, enemy phase, if that, or player phase rather, if that makes sense. Um, so wind sweep coincides with that, but we get to double because of courtly fan and then we've also got joint drive speed which is fine um so it seems like ethylene is pretty much just there to be what i would assume a glass cannony type of unit where uh, she's pretty much all attack and speed uh, everything about her kit pretty much says that so that is what i would assume on her very good. I'm glad we got a little Ethlyn love in here. <laughs> she is a princess. I don't care what anybody tells me. It's a really, really old. I am a military man first, um, not a dancer. Prince Hackney? What? Quan? Quan is here with Chris Hackney. We are in rarefied air, my friends. Uh, that was a Discord joke, in case anybody missed that. Had to have been around for a while to understand that joke, though. Dude, my man Chris Hackney up here playing Quan in such elegant attire. Come on. All right, Courtly Bow Plus. I wonder what this one's going to do. Am I right? Uh, effective against flying foes at start of combat. If unit's HP is greater than or equal to 50%, grants attack, defense, plus 5 during combat. And also, if foe can make follow-up attack, reduces damage from foe's first attack by 50%. Wait a minute. Hold on. Is Ethlyn a four star? Did they make Ethlyn a four star? I mean, we'll find out at the very end. But like, this is this is making me think that Ethlyn is the four star. Right? Because that's a tier four. They don't put that on four stars. That's not a thing. They put wind sweep on four stars. That's something that they do. Oh, that is interesting. Okay, attack defense bond four. Uh, so we have our newest bond tier four. So grants attack defense plus seven. Uh, it neutralizes units' penalties to attack defense during combat. Great. Flyer formation three, and then joint home defense. So nothing really super duper new, um, but I'm assuming he's going to be more physically tanky uh, based on kits and whatnot. So great stuff. Welcome to the party, Quan. So this is like a full genealogy banner, huh? Hmm. 
We'll also be getting a Tempest Trials. I think, right? It's a dream we share together. I'm praying for you. Who called it? Your man called it. All right. Guilt Goblet grants attack plus three. If foe initiates combat or if foe's HP is equal to 100%, at start of combat grants attack res plus six during combat. And also, if foe uses magic, reduces damage from attacks uh, during combat and from AoE's special by 50%. Good lord. Okay. So there's a lot happening there. Uh, yikers, that is a lot of premium skill on this duo, which it was a duo, right? I'm not, I'm not tripping. We are duoing. It doesn't say anything about not being, I, it's a duo because there's the same, the same game equals duo, different game equals harmonized. All right, so we have attack res bond four. Which I believe was only previously on Brave Micaiah, I think. And then we've got Attack Res uh, Lull. And then we've got Joint Hone Res, which is new. A new Joint Hone skill. Um, so that is going to grant Res plus 5 to unit and adjacent allies for one turn. If it's uh, next to somebody. Wow. Yeah. All right, so like any duo unit, uh, they're probably going to be a little bit busted. So let's see. Duo skill moves allies adjacent to unit to opposite side of unit. If ally cannot move to the target space, ally will not move. All right, well, that's fair. You know, we can't just hurdle people over cliffs or uh, stack people on top of one another. So that, yeah, that's fair. Um, I'm not really sure. Hmm. Alright, so the advantageousness of this, I'm assuming, would be they move ahead, duo skill, move everybody in front of them, right? Is that what I'm is that what I'm gathering from this? I guess we'll find out. <laughs> I could just play the clip and find out. That's another option, I guess. Your hand. Yeah, alright, so that's gonna move. Arden in front, I guess. Never be apart. Of course, dearest. Ah, okay. So it's not in front; it's just opposite-sided. Interesting. Okay, so that's kind of like getting three spaces if they end up dancing, right? Is that how I'm gathering that? Wait, so is Ethel a four-star? Hold on, who's that? Who is this? We know who that is. We know who that is. Oh, Lachesis is the four star. Okay. Well, that's unexpected. That's a little unexpected. They showed the four, the four star first. Although I guess given now that I'm seeing, <laughs> now that I'm seeing this, you guys have probably been screaming at me in the comments because you're all very quick to point out when I miss something. I guess that's nice. Um, okay, yeah, so she is definitely the four star. That makes sense. I guess I wasn't thinking, I listen, listen, okay, look. I got excited because I thought maybe Ethlyn would be a four star and my orb journey on this particular banner would not be that long. But wishful thinking is wishful thinking and that's just how it goes sometimes all right i don't i don't need you guys to yell at me right now all right i'm in a very vulnerable place in my life right now so let me drink my tea and feel foolish it's hot i shouldn't take a big sip but that's fine all right so yeah that, yeah, that makes sense so we have air orders in the four star pool that's limited <laughs> but not but still but, I mean, that's still okay. All right, so she green. So that's cool, I guess. Ethelon was colorless, I believe. Quan was blue. He a blue bow. And then we had red tome for the gang. Um, but they are calves, which is interesting. And they are definitely dance, right? They are. All right, so we. I think that... 
I think that is our first Cav Dancer. Right? I think that's our first Cavalier Dancer. So that's interesting. Um, hmm. 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 I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, it's nice. It does, it, listen, it makes Sigurd Deirdre very unique. It makes them very unique. Uh, more than likely, you won't be using them entirely as a dance squad, uh, if I'm, if I'm guessing. Which, who was, who was the lead on this? Did we see who the lead is? I think Deirdre is the lead, right? Did they say? No, Sigurd is. Okay. Deirdre is just in front. Probably because Sigurd is on a horse. I guess that, that takes precedence. Yeah, fair enough. If the horse was in front, then Deirdre would be all covered up. Uh, but this is definitely Sigurd. All right, so Sigurd has an ult. As did Deirdre, basically. And it counts. Listen, if Rhea counts for Summer Byleth, then Deirdre counts for uh, Dancer Sigurd. That's just how it goes. I don't make the rules, all right? I just report on them. Uh, that is interesting i am quite pleased with that uh yeah so we can see sigurd's stats up here um pretty much attack res heavy which again based on his kit uh not all of that surprising so there you go we'll take a look at this again just for funsies just because we can just because we can all right that was good All right, and I don't, I don't have my phone, and I don't have my game in front of me, but I'm pretty sure that's Elgin, uh, and you know, Eflin also, or no, Lachesis. One of them literally just used the name Eldigan, So, uh, dope dragon, by the way, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I don't know what's up with that. That must be like a genealogy thing, maybe that I'm not familiar with because I'm not a real Fire Emblem fan, apparently. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, those are cool. I'm down. All right, this video's gone on way too long. Listen, um, this is sweet. I'm excited. I don't have any uh, personal stock in anybody other really than Ethelin and Sigurd, but that is fine. We have a four-star green unit, so that's pretty hype because those stones don't tend to pop up all that frequently. Um, and then Quan is also here because it's a party. Quan party. Okay, I don't make the rules. I just report on them. So, uh, let me know in the comments who you are most excited for in this banner. Ethelin Sigurd. I can't tell which one because uh, Ethelin I would, I would just like to have and Sigurd it seems like it would be a good idea to get a copy of him. <laughs> Slash Deirdre, if at all possible. Um, so that is it for me right now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hey, if you're in the States, enjoy your three-day weekend, if you have one, because I, I think it's Labor Day. That might be a thing for some of you, I don't know. I, I've i honestly forgotten what any holiday looks like at this point, because I've just been inside for the last six months. Um, but, that is it for me right now. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Be sure to check out the memberships video if you're interested in that. Uh, that'll be linked in the description. Again, let me know who you're most excited for on this banner. That's it for me. I'm going to get going. Thank you for watching, and until then, I will catch you next time.